Jeff Carter. Uh, third and a seven. There we go. That's what I want to see. So we get that. <clears throat> Excuse me. Excuse me again. There we go. Get that JVR contract unloaded. He only put up like 40 points last season. Um, opposed to Carter, who's on less money for less time. Uh, about 2 million less. I put up, I think, a little bit. Just about the same, if not a little bit more points than JVR. So that's always great to see right there. So after just need two seconds, I'll get right into this episode right here, I guess. Yo, what is up, YouTube? It's your boy, the franchise guy, back at it again. And as you just saw, we just brought back Flyers Legend. Jeff Carter, he's he's on the cusp of legendary. He should never have been traded. Him and Mike Richards should have been lifers for the Flyers. Only reason they were traded uh, was because they wanted to bring I love Brzgalov. And uh, that didn't work out too well, as you guys know. Brzgalov is going to be paid for the next, like, 15 years uh, by the Flyers. And he's not even playing in the NHL anymore. But, yeah, now we brought him back. And, uh, he's going to be playing on the second line with Konechny, and I forget who else is on my second line. And there we go. First shot of the season, and it's a goal on Connor Hellebuck. That's what we like to see right there. Starting off the season right with a goal, first shot of the game. That's Giroud Couturier. That ginger line, unstoppable. Look at that. Mikatoria is 27. He's. That's actually uh, Jakub Voracek right there at the assist. Not a. Uh... Not Giroud. I was close. Close, but no cigar. But, uh. Let's see. Uh, does it say who. No? Okay. Come on. Another thing though with uh, Richards, not Richards, uh, Carter, he's getting a lot of power, he's in a lot of power play time. So. Oh, where's Line A? Alright. Up to Giroux. Voracek, who has led our team in points the last two seasons. And here he is, Jeff Carter. And his first shot of the season is going to go in. Jeff Carter, welcome back to Philadelphia. Oh, that's a goal right there. I mean, the Kings wanted to offload some money. I mean, I don't think, I mean, the Kings wanted to get a little younger, really. That's what they wanted to do. They took JVR off our hands. JVR on a $7 million contract for three more years. So that's about $21 million in cap space. Like, another $21 million wrapped up um, for uh, Carter. He's at $5.7 million for the next two years. So... I mean, if anything, it's we we end up winning that trade because we only have him for it's almost like the Joe Thornton trade from last season. We just we get him for a two-year rental, pretty much, on a kind of expensive contract. Not he's not gonna make or break us. I mean, we're gonna lose. Um, we're gonna lose. Uh, what's this? Uh, Joe Thornton. Uh, this offseason. Anyway, I'm not going to re-sign him at 41 years of age. Um, 
that's just that's just common sense right there. You don't resign a 41 year old center. Uh, I do know we do have some prospects coming up. We have Morgan Frost. We have. Uh, I don't know. We have some prospects. We have the Suzuki brothers down there. But, uh, that's about it for prospects. Like, big prospects. I mean, we have Ratcliffe. Um, no one else, really. No big prospects. That's how Suzuki brothers. We didn't really draft anyone big last season who took forward to that immensely. A couple of defensive prospects, I think, maybe. Um, but yeah, we'll free up some spaces, uh, we'll lose Thor anyway, uh, Reeves will not be re-signed. Uh, just common, common things, just depth signings right there. Um, I forget what his name is, but I signed him, he's a backup left winger. He's on our bench right now. But yeah, you'll see, I guess, at the end of this season, what I'll be doing. There we go, look at that. Bobrovsky putting in the work. Kasha with the puck. It's his NHL debut. So the past couple seasons, we've had, had a few players make their NHL debuts. I mean, we had... Uh, what was it? We had Vorobyov in the first season. Last season was uh, Abu Kubel. This season is Kasha. I mean, I mean, there's some pretty good. They're pretty decent, I guess, players to call up. They're not franchise altering players. Oof. Yeah. So yeah, no, they uh, that power play was not effective at all. Our penalty killers did not do their jobs. Uh, it's uh, uh now a one-two game. He has never a good sign. All right, Bobrovsky. Come on, Bobrovsky. All right, Voracek with the puck. There we go. That's what we gotta do. Just dump it in there. Voracek is gonna keep the A. I do realize that Jeff Carter uh, was an alternate captain at his first stint with Philly. I feel like it's better that Voracek keeps keeps it, at least for now. Probably better that Vorchek keeps it. I mean, Vorchek's earned it. Alright. Taylor Lear taking the puck up. Oh boy. Yeah. Honey, right there. There we go, just clear that. There we go. Uh, we have 10 on 7 shots. Uh, time attack literally the same. Our passing has got awful. Uh, 2 hits to 1 hit, and uh, we have a 3 1 lead. Come on. 
Let's just hit your defender when you're uh, trying to clear it. Alright, line A. Oh, boy. Yep. Was that a second goal of the game? I mean, Pafraski is not having a good game. Alright. I'm pretty sure we just passed that right to him. Alright. Carter. Alright. I mean, as long as Jeff Carter's not, doesn't get injured, I'll, I'll get there, Patrick. I mean, as long as Carter doesn't get hurt this season, there's no reason he shouldn't be a 50-point scorer, because that's what he was last season. I mean, there we go. Look at that. Jakob Borchek, his second goal of the game. Look at that. It's gonna be, who, gets a, who gets a hat trick first? Us? Is it going to be Borchek or is it going to be uh, that other guy? Which gets the rebound right there. It's heads up offense. Look at that. Just heads up offense right there to bury that puck. Look at that. Perfect pass right there. Alright. Alright, Moran. All right, or don't pass it out. It's cool. Look at that. It's an official souvenir replica puck night. Well, just regular puck night, I guess. Cause I don't know what a replica puck is. All right. What is Couturier still doing up here? There we go, Bobrovsky. Way to, way to bury that. Way to, way to do that, Bobrovsky. I'm proud of you. Way to be worth that $7 million we pay you. Oh boy. There we go. Alright. Fabio, Kasha, Abuki Bell. This is a great line. All right. Nope, or don't pass it the right way. How is, how is it icing if the goalie gets it? It doesn't count as icing. How are you gonna, how are you gonna count the
He's over 24, he should have played that better. That was a big hit taken by Kasha. Nice take between the legs pass right there. Jumbo Joe. Up to Reeves. The Flyers continue on at the no, that's the so many. So many bad passes. And he steps across the line. Let's the shot fly. That's a good save on the slot keeper. Takes the good one. No celebration this time. Nope. That's so light. Such a light little shot right there. Not entirely sure why that was so light. Alright. Uh, 22 shots to 15 shots. Uh, 4 to 1 hits. Passing 72 to 93. Face offs, we've won 6. We've had 2 penalties, and they've uh, killed 2 penalties with their power play goals. By Dustin, uh, by Foglin, that guy. Uh, Yakov Vorchak, two goals. So you're Brusky, yeah, he's doing, he's doing fine. He's doing good enough. Alright, Goss is spare up to. Four check. The Flyers wheel it up the wing. He sends one on the oh. Great kill. Blitz to Shifley. Should have buried that one. Offside. There we go. Oh, that one gets the one on the way. Oh, boy. Come on. There we go. Oh, come on. We're going for the puck. That's a bad one. I don't like that one. That's bad. That's an ugly one right there. Lear connect me. This is a weird this is a weird power play line. There we go. Finally get a decent clear out. Nice, uh, that's a goal that just no one was able to stop the boards there. Bill Elvin, good precision in the slot. All right, Philadelphia is getting in their own end. That is just gonna skate it up. Carries it on in from Shifley. Okay, from that cluster of players in the net. Now it's Shifley to Little. The Jets are up the wing. I'm not gonna get a little dribble in. Come on, Tana Hellebuck. I heard there's a stipulation you don't allow third period goals. So I need to. I need to, need to prove uh, that right. I need to prove you wrong. There's Line A right there. I haven't seen Line A that much, actually. 
don't know if I just haven't been paying attention because he's obviously had to not had to puck a lot. Or I just haven't been out. It's weird. Oh. Yep. That is a net off. Oh. There we go. There we go. Oh, and we missed it. Nope. All right. Come on. Yeah, man. Losing the point. Way up there. A terrific try and catch denied. There we go. Up to Jeru. And Myers lugged that along up the wing. Score just chipped back on the ice again. This move is going to be going aggressive for too long. The Jays don't want to take a dull move with a score like this. Big time move. Oh, look at look at him go. There we go. I thought he'd pay a goalie seven million. There we go. Is that a deflection goal right there? I'm not sure if that's gonna count as does that count for Thornton or is that count for Voracek? That's count for Thornton right there. I bounced off him and fivefold it. Yep, count for Thornton. <sighs> That's unfortunate. There we go, up to Reeves. Oh. Not the best passes from Reeves. Come on. There we go. One last bump, bastic bunch. Philadelphia's got a little bit of swagger going now. Their man's won the fight. The crowd is ecstatic. I like. That's how I brought him in. That's why I like that line. It's, I mean, Reeves definitely should probably be on the fourth line with uh, Vorobiev, and Kubel should be on the third line with. Um, Thornton. Uh, but I just like there's just how much muscles on that line. Because you think you have Thornton and Reeves on that line. That's a lot of muscle. There we go. Oof. Come on, there. Who is out on this line? There was Varabiov, there's Jeru, there's Couturier. 
right. They started to slow down the opposition when they were three quarters. That's over three minutes remaining. You see a pattern developing here. They're up now by three. All right. There we go. There we go. Jack of Vorchek gets the Hattie. Opening day Hattie. Look at that. Three assists for Couturier. Three goals for Vorchek. That's that's what we run right there. That's what happens when you shoot a bunch. You shoot a bunch, you get goals. A four goal lead right now. Couturier and Hag both their Hag get uh, assists. Yep. Not Wheeler has it. Come on, nope. There we go. Send it all the way down. Oh boy. That was almost in right there. Oh boy, that was a close one. That was a close one right there. I almost, almost left a third goal. Why was Allmark out there? Allmark wasn't even play this game. All right, so we'll take Andrew. So we had uh, first star Jakub Voracek, three goals, three assists, six points. Two star went Sean Couturier with one goal, three assists, and three star went Sergey Bobrovsky, two goals allowed, twenty-seven saves for a nine-thirty-one save percentage. All right, if you guys like this episode, make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe. If you guys missed this episode, make sure you guys check the playlist down below. We are in year number three now, so if you do have some catching up to do, if you are new to the series, I do recommend watching from episode one. Um, it's a fun series, I like it. But yeah, peace out, rock on YouTube.